What's good guys, Prince Sports here, live from the beach. I know I took a while, I disappeared a little bit. You know, I was doing business stuff, took a little break. To me, it's, I'm like on vacation mode. But anyway, there's a lot of stuff on my mind I want to get off. And one of them is these two bozos, Draymond Green and Kevin Durant. First of all, Draymond Green, why are you coming in the defense of Kevin Durant as if it's not justified to criticize Kevin Durant. Oh, believe me, he deserves every bit of blame and criticism coming his way. First of all, you say, why are you mad at Kevin Durant for requesting the trade? Listen, you big dummy, you highly glorified role player. Kevin Durant is under contract. Now, if your small brain can't comprehend what a damn contract is, how about you hire somebody to do a job for you, you pay them money, and then they up in arms and quit on your black ass. That is called unprofessional, non-leadership, and stuff suckers do. So we have a right to criticize Kevin Durant for being a bozo and wanting to be traded when the Brooklyn Nets bend over backwards for this guy, gave him everything he wanted, and you want to leave because they don't want to take care of your boyfriend, Kyrie Irving. Man, when you going to be a leader and think for yourself, Kevin Durant? All right? Be a real man. Okay, now I'll go back to your dumb ass, Kevin Durant. Woo! You blew it. Collective bargaining comes because these owners are fed up and tired with these players trying to tell them what to do and how to run their own franchise. So you got a guy like Kevin Durant and some of you try to cap for Kevin Durant wanting a trade request. He came to the... The Brooklyn Nets. Nobody forced him to come here. He was playing father the leader and followed Kyrie Irving to the Brooklyn Nets. That's on you. Look at that way. Oh, that felt good though. Now I'm gonna go to your dumb ass, Kevin Durant. First of all, you say people are mad at you because you're requesting the trade. Why are you on the contract? I might add. You signed the damn contract. You signed on the dotted line. Anyway, you said we mad at you because we're protecting our favorite players. Otherwise, Giannis, Steph, and LeBron James. Okay, you big dummy. First of all, you never beat Steph Curry. You was up three games to one, and you pussied out on him, and then you went and joined his ass, okay? That's like somebody getting punched in the face, then go back rocking with them, or somebody um, doing something bad to you, then you try to be friends with them the next minute, all right? So that was a sucker move on your part. So how are you even going to surpass Steph when you never beat him, you dumb, you big dummy. All right, then your second one is Giannis Antetokounmpo. Last time I checked, Giannis uh, won a championship in 20, 2021. Knock your ass out in the playoffs. That's the end of that, all right? Then you got LeBron James, a guy that you beat, yeah, but you had to beat him by joining a Golden State Warriors team that was already a good team and a championship contending team that won 70 plus games. Now granted, LeBron James did super teams too, so he's not off the hook on that. But at the same time, you think you're gonna get real credit for beating uh, LeBron James when both of y'all was on super teams, big threes, you know? So you could miss me with those those um, championships you won with the Warriors. Yeah, you won them, but do they have any meaning to them? No. Do they have any value to them? No, this is why people calling you out. Because you can't step up to the plate and be a man and win a championship like a true alpha, like a true G. Won't you win one with the Brooklyn Nets? You got Ben Simmons, you could trade Kyrie Irving for good, decent players. Why won't you do that then? Ah, uh, you're too scared, you're too, you're too much of a, a sissy. Whatever, man. But that's my take on Draymond Green coming to the defense of Kevin Durant. We have every right to call out these fake leaders and these fake all-stars like Draymond Green. I'm out. Peace. Look at those waves. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. You see that? Look at those waves from this beach. Sports out, peace.